Maria Walsh, the 2014 Rose of Tralee, is a past pupil of Presentation College Hedford, to where she recently paid a visit. We're absolutely thrilled and delighted with the whole event. Um, from the minute that we knew that the Rose was arriving to the school, the enthusiasm, the excitement um, has been just wonderful. And the support, the collegiality from uh, all staff in the preparation of this event and indeed the interest and enthusiasm within the student body has been amazing. So we're absolutely thrilled with the success and delighted that the rain has stayed off for us just for that little while this morning as well, even though it's quite cold here today. Tell me a little bit about how you feel coming back to your old school. It's um, absolutely breathtaking. I wasn't expecting such a huge uh, foray or party or celebration. Um, I was hoping I could sneak in and sneak back out again, but um, the teachers here are definitely just excited to celebrate and the students are too. And you could just, feel, I mean, it was just, it was just great excitement. Returning to the scene of many, many crimes. <laughs> Tell me a little bit about your memories of the school. Oh, uh, you know, I mean, we were actually one of the only, well, I was involved in so many different attributes of it. Uh, the musical, the musicals, um, sports was a huge part of my life. Uh, we were, I think we are still the only um, uh, team, the soccer team, to win an All-Ireland medal in under 18, and that was another big celebration. Actually, similar to how we just came up there, that's how we came up um, when I was in my junior cert year. Um, and then just, oh, you know, this is where the crack happens, you know, and this is where you grow and this is actually where you figure out who you are and what you are. And I was linked to all these youth organizations like No Name and the Pioneers. So um, it's, gr it's just so, it's great to be back. I'm actually very speechless. <laughs> Music is an integral part of the ethos at the school. In terms of music, well, we provide it as junior search subjects, so that's first year right up to uh, junior search or third year. And then it's offered at senior level as well from uh, fifth year uh, to leave and search and also as part of the TY curriculum. Um, music as a subject, uh, there's three main aspects to it. There's composition, there's performing and there's listening. And um, we, uh, we welcome every student in first year, you know, from various musical backgrounds. And uh, having said that, you know, we, we, we welcome students that have no musical background. And it's up to us as a music department, myself and my colleagues, Siobhan Shatnessy, to, um, to basically uh, glean musical talent from each student and then we nurture that and foster that talent and basically they can uh, they can reach their highest potential musically so that's our job and we enjoy doing that and uh, you know it's a very very enjoyable subject and uh, the students really really enjoy the practical side of things and we put a lot of emphasis on the practical so um, we often have loads of practical classes uh, both at, at junior level and senior level as part of the course and uh, you know you have an array of students come from various musical backgrounds and a, a lot of different instruments so you can try and and integrate all those instruments into a practical class so say for example you know you might try something that's current in the, in the charts at the moment uh, most most recently we tried a bit of Taylor Swift Shake It Off and you have all the students involved so yeah it's, it's really fun and they really enjoy it. This is the business room. First years have a choice of studying business. In junior cycle we study business, economics, accounting, bookkeeping, budgeting and much more. In fifth year, we have a choice of studying accounting, business, and economics. In TY, we can set up many companies to raise money for our TY activities. Sport is a particular passion at Presentation College Hedford. We're a mixed school, a very large school, so uh, we provide a lot, of, a lot of different sporting activities. Uh, we play football, soccer, hurling, rugby, basketball, athletics, and uh, this year we've provided uh, table tennis and chess as well. We've both 60 to 80 students involved in that, so uh, a lot of different activities available for the students. Obviously, it wouldn't be possible without uh, all the cooperation we get from staff and management, so we have over 20 staff involved in all the various activities, and you know, they give their free time willingly, and you know, it's great that we have that. Um, obviously, facilities are very important for us as well, but there's so many sporting activities in place, so uh, we get great cooperation from the local clubs. Um, the Hedford GA Club down the town there, we play all our all the boys and Gaelic, uh, boys, Gaelic, girls, Gaelic uh, matches are always played down there. We have the soccer club, the local soccer club, Moyne Villa. Uh, we play all our soccer matches, do all our training down there. And we have the local rugby team, uh, local rugby club, then it's Carb Rugby. 
Uh, they have facilities here at the back that we share with them and they also get involved in coaching in the evening. So uh, all in all, there's fabulous facilities here. Our curriculum is extensive. Um, this year we're introducing technology into the first year curriculum and science is a core. So every student coming in does science. Science has always had a high uptake by students at Presentation College Hetford when it was offered as an optional subject. Today science is a compulsory subject and at present all incoming first years take science at Presentation College and this will continue into the future. At Senior Cycle we have seen further expansion of science with all of the five following subjects currently being included. Biology, Agricultural Science, Chemistry, Physics and Applied Maths. This gives students a wide and varied choice with regards to third level courses and careers in the science field. To cater for the increased demand in science uptake at both junior and senior cycles, we have currently five science labs in operation. There are eight optional subjects. Um, uh, technology, woodwork, metalwork, um, technical graphics, uh, home economics, business studies and along with the core subjects and also SPHE and CSPE and we've big emphasis then for all students to participate in sports and extracurricular activities. Now in Leaving Cert besides the core subjects of Irish, English, Maths we offer French and German and I should also add this year in first year we're introducing Spanish so now we have three languages on offer and in terms of optional subjects we offer a huge uh, level of variety. Well to be honest we're fairly blessed with Irish in the school we have I think about four or five very dedicated Irish teachers and they really do look after the students they try to give us as much Irish as they can and to be honest to be fair it shows in the leaving certain junior cert results like every room as you see this one we have posters all over the walls to do with Irish anything and I think every year we take part in Shock and the Gaelga or um, any type of competition to do with Irish. greatest, greatest moments of my PCH days was um, winning an All-Ireland medal with the two boys in the back, uh, Mr. Gilmore and Mr. O'D. Um, and that wasn't short of a few sprints, uh, a, few, a few long training sessions and, and many great bus journeys right across the country when, and bringing that medal back. Um, and uh, I'm just in awe of just how, how wonderful, even after all these years, the legacy of how great PCH just continues. Um, and that's that's an attribute to all the wonderful teachers. Um, many are still here, and I know there's a lot of new faces, and hopefully I get to spend uh, quality time with all of you. PCH has been the anchor to me. Um, it has given me um, the life lessons, uh, and I've learned, you know, all my best years were spent here. Um, and I'm extremely proud, extremely proud to be uh, a former student here. and. Um, wherever I go, I always share my stories, and many of them have happened here. So thank you very, very, very much for welcoming me.